an explosion of emotion as the Aggies say howdy to the 12th man and get ready to greet Clemson number two in the nation tonight. Third and 15 in this noise. Bryant throws a dart and loses Amari Rogers. Rogers is on his way in the AM territory. Push him out of bounds with the first huge explosive play of the night for Clemson. Kelly Bryant keeps it. He beats Alaka to the corner. Touchdown, Clemson. That's what Kelly Bryant brings to the table. Clemson is coming out with the freshman phenom Trevor Lawrence. Lawrence going up top. Oh, and his first pass is complete. And it might be a touchdown to T. Higgins if he's got enough gas. Higgins trying to get to the corner. Is he going to make it? Touchdown, Tigers. Welcome to the big time, Trevor Lawrence. 64 yards. Number five goes up and over to make that play and then shows speed to get it into the end zone. Four previous trips inside the 25 for AM. They have to finish this one. Kellen Mond into the end zone. Puts it in traffic. Touchdown, Texas AM. It's Kendrick Rogers. They'll toss it to him. To the corner. Into the end zone. And Clemson answers the AM touchdown. Two. Pressure's picked up. Davis with another catch. He's got a first down. Did Davis stay on his feet? Headed to the corner. The ball flew out. They're saying that it was a fumble through the end zone and a touchback. That's important. The call on the field is touchback. I don't know that, I, that they have enough at this point to overturn. After review, the ruling on the field stands. First down. Two if plays, and the Aggies are inside the 25, still with 52, 52 seconds to play. Seconds. The rush in the corner, Farrell almost gets by, and in the middle. Touchdown! Touchdown, Kendrick Rogers! They're tearing the lid off the place, but you got to get the two. Let's look at this catch again. Kendrick Rogers with the focus off the tip ball. Ball never came close to touching the ground. For the time with 46 seconds to play. Mine rolling. Farrell there's a flag. Mine's got to throw it, and it's intercepted. Clemson goes on the road and beats Texas A&M by a deuce. All right, Coach, you walk out of here with a two-point win. Describe the test that your team just passed. Well, you only need one more point than they have, so let's be happy about that. But, man, listen, to come on the road, you know, what an unbelievable environment. I mean, unbelievable. What a special place to, to, to be a part of college football. You know, but early in the season, and uh, neither team wants to lose. You saw that tonight. You saw the heart of both teams, and I uh, thought they did a great job. They had a great plan. You know, we, we kind of, we bent a lot. We didn't, we missed on some opportunities. We kind of had a low offensively. Then we came back and lit it up. Defensively, we were lighting up, then we went a low, so it was just kind of back and forth. But at the end of the day, somehow we found a way to win by, by two points. And uh, you know what? It gets us to 2-0, and, and that's really what we came out here to do, to get to 2-0 and and grow our team. That's what I talked about all week. This is a game that we can really grow from uh, because, you know, it's our first time to play an opponent like this in a while, and uh, they did a heck of a job. They had a heck of a plan. Uh, hats off to, to Texas A&M and Jimbo. But uh, we're, we're thankful that we got the win. Proud of our guys. Long embrace there with Jimbo at the end. You won round nine. What did you want him to know about what his team well, did? Well, I just told him, I mean, just, you know, that's, that's, a, that's a tough one right there to lose for either side. You know, both teams fought incredibly hard. He's proud of his team. I'm proud of my team. It's a game of a few plays when you're playing, you know, big boy football. And uh, it was a few plays tonight. But, but I just told him, you know, congratulations on what he's done his, his, here already uh, to see this environment and to see his kids fight to the last second you know what that's what it's all about and uh they can grow from this as well and we were fortunate to come out on top no doubt about it real quick does the quarterback philosophy change moving forward we saw kelly b the entire fourth quarter yeah well you know that's that's it, it, it you got to pay attention to the game and uh trevor did some great things uh we'll continue to to play those guys for sure i don't see that changing but i thought kelly stepped up big for us and showed his leadership and his experience when we had to have it down the stretch so uh, Trevor came in and, you know, kind of hard, hard to start even better than he did. Uh, but proud of both of them. But, uh, you know, I thought Kelly really settled in and gave us, uh, you know, the heart of a champion down the stretch. Right, thanks for your time. Yeah.